Have you ever choked on food or on water? Those painful moments of coughing? People often say that you choked because the food went into the wrong pipe. What do they mean by the term wrong pipe? Well, let's see. When you breathe in, the air travels through your nasal cavity and into the pharynx. From the pharynx opens two passages which have the same opening. One passage is the windpipe which enters your lungs and the other one is the food pipe that opens into your stomach. Now, they have the same opening and that's where the tricky part of channeling the traffic comes. This is why we have a valve which looks like a flap and is called the epiglottis. When you swallow, this epiglottis partially covers the tube which goes into the lungs, that is the windpipe, therefore deflecting the food naturally into your food pipe. And when you breathe in, the epiglottis uncovers the windpipe, therefore the air goes into your lungs. Now, do you think that you're controlling the functioning of your epiglottis? Well, not really. It's the nervous system in your body that controls the function of this epiglottis. The next time you're eating, try to put your palm on your neck when you're gonna swallow. You'll observe that your breath is arrested for that one moment. This is a function of epiglottis covering your windpipe. This is why your elders often say to not talk while eating. Because when you talk, you take in air. And what if by mistake, the food goes into the wrong pipe? You know the painful consequences you have to face. So, what have we learned today? We have learned about the wonderful epiglottis and the passage of air. Until next time, happy learning!